All right, guys, uh, lockdown's finally over, so we're getting out and about again. Um, cars all packed up. We're going out to Kenilworth camping this weekend um, for our friend's kids' birthdays. Unfortunately, Hannah and Charlie will be hanging back at the house. Um, Charlie's got a bit of a cough and we, it's still too cold for her out there, we reckon, so uh, we'll hit the road now, won't we? We'll meet up with Stump at the service centre uh, and we'll get on the way. Guys, don't forget, hit that subscribe button. Turn on notifications and give me a huge thumbs up. Bye. shade out um, we're just gonna try and spread out as much as we can so when everyone else gets here they've got uh, somewhere to set up um, but other than that we've got a big open space um, and it overlooks the creek which is pretty cool and there's a track there that'll get us right down to the water so I think we got a nice little spot here don't you yeah yeah so do I Kenilworth Camping is set on a 580-acre family-owned dairy farm, which produces roughly 2.5 million litres of milk a year. The farm was opened to camping a few years ago to help the dairy farm through financial hardship and has grown to be a popular destination for campers. With plenty of wide open space and its close proximity to Kenilworth, it's easy to see why. Quite the fresh morning to wake up to. It's freaking sick, it's so foggy. Uh, it's the two boys' birthday today, so we'll make some brekkie. Uh, and then we'll probably go up to Kenilworth Bakery and have some fun. What's on the menu, Chef Stump? Standard, bacon and eggs. So, so you got all out in our broad house brands as well, mate? Yeah. We're a little bit fancy. You do. Men who can cook, eh? Get around it. Breakfast is done, uh, done all the washing up. We're just packing up all the loose bits. Uh, then we're gonna get uh, head off to the bakery, um, get the boys some donuts for their birthdays, uh, and then see where the day takes us. You got your birthday uh, challenge, your one kilo donut? Yep. Let's see it. Oh. Good luck, bro.
adjacent to a five kilometer stretch of the Mary River and is accessible through the entire campground, so you often have patches of the creek to yourself. The creek is home to a colony of platypus, which are often seen playing in the river. Please remember, if you do see them, to keep your distance and let them do their thing. The river is also home to a unique Mary River lungfish, which is often sighted. However, they are also protected and must be left alone. Fishing is allowed in the river, however anything caught must be returned to the waterways. Unfortunately, our weekend's come to an end. Um, we've got to get the little one home for school tomorrow. Um, these guys are staying for another day. Um, they had a long weekend booked already before this got pushed because of lockdown. So they're going to utilize the extra night they've already paid for. Uh, we're going to get all this packed up. We've already started. Most of the stuff's in the car. Just got the swag to roll up and put on the roof. Um, I think we're going to then hit some four-wheel drive tracks. Um, so I'll probably chuck some footage of that at the end. Um, it's it's pretty pretty good spot here. Um, right on the water. The water runs the whole length of the park, which is kind of cool. It makes it super easy to get in anywhere. Um, we got a high bit that actually overlooks uh, the water, so it's a little trek down for us, but we chose that because we had the, the little ones running around and, and a two-year-old as well, so it was just safer for us to get well back from the water. Um, super clean, toilets every 20 meters. Um, uh, the toilets get cleaned twice a day, which is kind of cool. Um, they get cleaned and, and refreshed with water morning and night. Um, Yards, super clean, uh, no prickles at all, which is really cool for the dogs. Um, it's dog friendly, um, and other than that, five minute trek to Kenilworth, can't really complain. Um, but yeah, thanks for hanging out with us, guys, um, and look, uh, look forward to seeing you next time. Thanks.